Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog video. As you can tell, the uh, lighting is not the very best, so you probably won't be able to see me. But I'm currently in the middle of fixing a couple of hot pockets. So I just wanted to drop an update. I'm currently work getting familiarized with Lightworks. And in case you don't know what Lightworks is, Lightworks is a um, video editing software like Sony Vegas and Adobe Premiere and also Final Cut Pro. Um, so basically, overall, put my tablet down here. Lightworks has been used on a lot of award winning films, which I'm actually not entirely sure of. But, um, looking at it from here, Lightworks seems to be pretty well and also works pretty well with Linux. And I don't know if you can see me or not. My tablet doesn't have the best of camera, as you can tell. I was expecting more out of the camera for 300 bucks, but hey, what do you know? It's a tablet. It works really nice for me. But I'm going to try getting some views done, well, at least try to do some video recording tonight. Once I can figure out a good software that I could use for Linux that will allow me to do my video recordings for my webcam and my red microphone that I used in my latest video review. Alright. Put this in. Hot packets are pretty good, but they're not the most healthiest of snack. But they work. Send it for. Alright, off I go to the living room. Where the lighting is a little bit better. So I was able to do um any videos this previous month except for that video review that I did. Um I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I just wanted to drop another update. Ronnie has actually decided to email Genius for me. Seeing I just wasn't expecting him to do that. Um Supposedly, Genius will be sending me a new energy mouse, which I'm actually excited about. It might take a little while being coming from California. So, I gotta get a hold of Genius again and see what the holdup is. But, like I said, some of the products are actually pretty good. And the fault of the USB receiver was mine, due to the fact that I still had it plugged into my laptop and I was also rushing around for school. So, and as I said in my last blog video, don't go leaving your receiver plugged in your laptop when you're in a hurry because you will bend the PCB or if not, break it. Like essentially what I did. So I'm just standing in my living room, lots of glow on my tablet. And I am in the process of working on some new bio PC videos right now because I'm just getting the updates done up for the... Um, new line of different media center PCs. I'm, I'm also going to try doing a few all around PCs for like CAD, video editing, gaming, and also uh, home theater use. See how much more time is left in my two hot packets and I think it's different. I think it's nice to be cat poop. But then there's a towel here for me to wipe my feet off on. My two hot packets are almost done, so about another 30 to 40 seconds yet. So, um, again, just looking at it from here, I should be able to get some new videos out for you guys this month. Well, seeing the month is nearly gone. And I've just been busy with college and still looking for a job, but I had to put a halt on that due to the fact that my right knee nearly gave out the other week because of soft cartilage. So I'm going to be getting a doctor's appointment, getting that updated. I th thought you guys would probably enjoy that, and my two hot pockets are done. Oh yeah, they're done. Eh, grab me a plate here. Yes, microwave. Me two hot pockets right there. 
And one of the things that I don't like about my tablet is the fact that the camera is not centered. So it makes it a little hard for me to shoot video with the camera on here. And I'm going to turn the kitchen light off. Make sure the door is locked. And of course, you can't see me right now. Now you can. So, I just wanted to give you guys a uh, quick update on what I do have planned. And I will definitely be doing some more tech tips because some of the upcoming ones I have is utilities that you can use on your USB flash drive to help troubleshoot computers. And I might do a quick tutorial on how to add software to your own custom Hiren Boot CD. Because Hiren's Boot CD is a very useful tool. And one of the tools I use the most often is NTP W Editor, something like that. It's a, yeah, excuse me. It's a tool to actually remove passwords from Windows. It works from Windows XP to Windows 7. Don't know about Windows 8. But like I said, I'm not completely sure about Windows 8, which if it can be done or not. But it's a very useful software to... It's a very handy piece of software. You can't even crack BIOS passwords with it, which is what I like. And, I recent, and some of the new networking equipment that I got was actually a trade from my um, ASUS EPC 701SD. It was a pretty decent netbook, but once the SSD failed on it that I got from Cosmosis Magnus, which I traded two gigs of my DDRM, but I abused the hell out of that SSD because I was constantly loading movies on and off on it. I think that's what wore. I think that's what wore it down. But I traded it to my friend, who is in my class, who is a big Linux user. So he has a 16 gigabyte SD card running Arch Linux on it, and I tell you, it actually loads pretty quick for an SD card. And I'm glad that I, I'm glad that someone else is able to use that netbook of mine. And I still gotta find the two gig stick of RAM yet too. And here comes Freya downstairs. Eh, this month has actually been pretty eventful. In terms of good tech stuff and... Some of the stuff that's been going in the tech world has been very interesting. And also something I recently found out that the New York State Board of Education is basically going to have their own little NSA spinoff. And what that is basically meant to do is um, spy on students essentially, but this is in the school system. I guess they're going to be selling it to other companies, probably for like job offers or something like that. I'm not completely sure on how that works, so I'm going to have to do a little bit more research. And So be prepared to have another Skull Rant coming up as a blog, because a lot of the rants I've done were on Tech Syndicate, and I have a couple on Tech Syndicate. One was um, Macs are cheaper than PCs. And then the other one, meddling with school property or other property that does not belong to you. So I might do a couple of videos on that. So be stay tuned for some rant videos. And I got something in between my foot here. Shake it off. And this plug has been boring, but I'm also half asleep as you can tell. And I'm just down here getting me something to eat. I'm gonna go get one of my hot pockets. Typical college meal. It's all ramen noodle. Now my, for my live streams. I'm still working on trying to transition into Linux. But if I can find a way to get um, Linux working with OBS, I should be set to go. But I might have to use Wine, so I don't know how well that's actually going to work. So, because like I said, I'm trying to dump Windows. See, with all the NSA bull crap and all that. If everyone gets what I mean. But otherwise, um, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog scene. It's actually one of my longer vlog videos. I might start posting these a little bit more of uh, some 
interesting ideas. But, um, I can't remember what me and my friend Jan were talking about. It was something about, like, DNA storage. I'll have to get a hold of him on that and include him on one of my next random idea videos. So, anyway, this is DJ from Skullvest logging out. You all have a good night.